Oracle Web Center Contents Inbound Refinery Server, also referred to as IBR, provides web viewable renditions of files as well as thumbnailing functionality. In this video, you will learn to extend an existing domain to include Inbound Refinery, configure the Inbound Refinery Server, configure Web Center Content for Conversion, and how to verify the conversion. As a component of Oracle Fusion middleware, WebCenter Content Server is installed in an Oracle WebLogic Server domain. In addition, the optional inbound refinery server should be installed. The WebLogic server port for administration server is typically 7001. 16200 for Web Center content and 16250 for inbound refinery server. If you have a working instance of Web Center content, add the inbound refinery functionality by extending that domain. One method to extend the domain is by using the Fusion Middleware Configuration Wizard. Once the inbound refinery functionality has been added and the servers restarted, log into inbound refinery. Add your specific subnet or IP address here for the Web Center content server in the incoming socket connection address security filter field. Set your web server HTTP slash HTTPS address, server instance name, server instance label and server instance description to instance. Then restart IBR. The final configuration on the inbound refinery server is to enable the PDF export converter component. There are other settings you can change if desired. For this video example, we will leave the defaults. In order to get the content server to communicate with the inbound refinery, you will need to create an outgoing provider. This is done from the Providers page of Content Server. Specify the desired settings, then restart the Content Server. In order for a file to be converted, the file format must be linked to a specific conversion which specifies how a file format should be processed. There are two methods for managing the file format conversion details using the file formats wizard page or using the configuration manager applet. Now you're ready to check in a content item for conversion. In this example, the native document is a Microsoft Office Word document which is being checked into the Web Center content server. In the content server's search results, you can see the thumbnail which was generated and upon clicking on the thumbnail you can view the web viewable rendition. For complete instructions on configuring inbound refinery please refer to the installing and configuring Oracle Web Center content guide. Thank you for watching. For more information please visit oracle.com slash webcenter and be sure to join in the conversation. Wow.